have found our rhythm, we have found how to best play together and uh, like our coach Gustavo, he was working with us a lot on like that simple things and all like um, yeah thank you for like we, we just trained, we just trained and here is the result. And this is a great event, we just enjoy being here as long as we can. And how great is it to have uh, fans back oh uh, there and also the Yesterday we uh, already talked with with um, Yanis and uh, Mamet. Uh, they also happy that uh, many Latvian fans are here. So how great is it? It's amazing, yeah, really, because uh, it was almost two years uh, playing without spectators, and you now such a huge event. And Vienna every time is so big, and the fans here they are so active. They sing, they dance, and we really love that because we feel this positive energy and we try to play as best as we can to give them also a good vibe. And let's uh, talk about the Olympics uh, last week. How was the experience as first uh, women's Latvian beach volleyball team and uh, one of the youngest teams in the whole tournament? How was the experience even uh, under these strange conditions? Um, everything was new because it was an interesting experience because it's the same volleyball, it's the same tournament, but those Olympic rings, they make all the difference and they change your perception. So it was uh, very nice to see how our team can perform under high pressure and it was I was so happy to see that we can do it very well. So that was nice. And Anastasia, Tasia, uh, explain us a little bit how difficult it was in the last year uh, to practice with Tina because for the people who don't know Tina was not uh, available because she played on yeah. the college. Like in the COVID year Tina took a gap year but then everything stopped and um, from the January uh, I went to US to train with Tina. Not many practices a week but still we, I was happy to train with her in US and practice against a good team so it was really a good experience and, and thank you for our federation and our sponsors that we had such a possibility to train in US in, a, in different countries. Yeah. Yeah.